Oh, she's so cute. You like babies, don't you, hon? Yeah, of course I do. <laughs> so we think so. Why'd you ask that? Well, I don't know. I just wondered. Hello. Hello. Oh God, I love the baby. There's someone to love and go for walks with in the park and play with. Our result. What is it? Well, we've got some tuna. Yes. And uh, potatoes. And we found some bread that we had left over. Yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> you star. Oh, oh, oh. Agent. What? What is it? I don't know. Green sweet corn, green peaches, let's call it tin surprise. <laughs> Nothing. Because there's nothing wrong, what are you bawling your eyes out? I'm happy. Happy? Yeah. I've been silly folks, only macaroni cheese. It's really sad. Something amazing's happened. Something is going to just change everything for the better. Well, what? Come on, don't keep me hanging. What? You got a job or something? No, it's only dark. What? We're going to have a baby. What? Done the test. It's positive. I'm pregnant. How? Well, when a daddy loves a mummy very much, they Jeez, get together. This is funny. I thought you'd be happy. Happy? We are living in a shitty, freezing cold flat, right? We haven't got anything to eat apart from stuff that we get out of cans. We don't even know what it is. We're getting it out of bins. We don't have any food. We don't have any clothes. We don't have any money. We ain't got any jobs. How exactly are we supposed to bring up a baby? Look, we'll be okay. We won't be okay, you stupid cow. Don't shout at me. Well, what did you think I was going to say? I thought you'd be excited. I thought you'd realise it gives us something to look forward to. It's something for You're the future. You're supposed to be on the pill. Yeah, I forgot. You forgot? Yeah, I forgot. How'd you forget to take the pill? Don't you understand? I, I want a baby. Well, I don't. What? There's no way that we can have this baby, Tracy. You're gonna have to get rid of it. Are you Are you asking me to get an abortion? Don't you understand? We can't. We can't just look after a baby. We're not a little girl anymore playing with your dollies. This is real life that we're How talking can about. You ask me to kill a baby! Listen. Listen. Tracy. Either you let me take you to the clinic and let me sort this out with you or you can sort this miss out on your own. I won't kill my baby. Fine. Well, you've made your decision, so you won't see me again.
please. I'm so sorry. I left my baby here. It was a mistake. Can I just have him to please? go to the police? How can you do that? Don't, no, don't go to the police. I'm sorry. It was a stupid mistake. I, I just want to have him back. Please. Come inside. You must be crazy. I'm hungry. I'm going to get a cup of tea. It's just something to eat. I don't want to be a pain. I just want my baby please, back. Please, come inside. Please. Thank you. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be a pain. You've been so kind. I read your letter. I'm really sad for you. But why did you think you needed to live like that? Oh, I don't know. I just felt so lost and so confused. And you know, when I was young, my dad ran away, and my mum was so depressed she just, she wouldn't get out of bed. And if she did, it, she'd hit me and shout at me. She just seemed to blame me for everything. I just used to dream about running away. And one day I did, I thought I'd go and live on the streets. It was not as easy as you imagine. Then I met Peter and I thought everything will be all right. He had somewhere to live. I mean, it was a squat, but it's a roof. And then I found out I got pregnant. And I thought that would be the start of everything. We could get a proper flat and proper jobs and have a proper life. So what happened? Oh, I don't think he could handle it. He left, I haven't seen him since. I didn't want that kind of life for him. So I panicked, I came here, I thought this is a nice area, I thought he'll just be alright. But I couldn't leave him. I love him, he's mine, and I got down the end of the road and I had to come back. I, whatever life is going to be like, I have to try. Tracy, you know, there's nothing wrong you asking for help. The single mum like you need the help. I, I don't want to be a pain. Take this money. No, I don't want to take your money. You should take it. It is not for you. It's for him. Okay, okay, I promise. Thank you. By the way, what's his name? It's Peter.